Hey guys, James Reese, CFE TV SHOT Show Industry Day at the Range 2024. This fellow over here, Josh, grabbed me whenever I was walking by, said, hey James, I heard that you like lightweight ARs, which is true, and you showed me this five pound, very polymer oriented yes. AR. And it's also gonna cost like, what, 400 bucks? Yeah, between four and $500 at retail. Okay, so inexpensive, lightweight. Josh, tell me everything about it. Yeah, we started with the uh, KE Arms private labeled lower. Uh, so this is private labeled for us. And this is a known quantity. It's been tested by oh, sure. uh, plenty of people. But what we wanted was to match it with an equally lightweight and similarly durable upper. And this is produced a little bit different than most polymer uppers. From the upper to the handguard is one piece. It clamshells like a DeWalt drill around a trunnion. The front trunnion, or the trunnion makes up the front takedown pin, where the rear takedown pin is are steel inserts. This is nearly our final revision. Our final revision will be available March 1st, and there'll be a few updates and improvements since this one. But it's uh, five pounds and sub 500 bucks. What's the name of the company? Wraithworks is the name of the company, and this is called the Warp 15. It stands for Wraithworks AR-15 Polymer. Okay, I thought it was going to be about, you know, because it's plastic and it's gonna warp right. whenever you, you shoot that's it, whenever a, it gets. That's a, that's a pun we should have thought about. Yeah, I'm nervous about sure, buying a, sure. a, a polymer upper AR-15. Sure. I, I think rightfully so. Okay. Reassure me, Josh. Uh, first off, we have several, several of these builds with uh, between 2,500 and 5,000 shots. We have sent them out for destructive testing We've done destructive testing ourselves. Um, yes, the plastic will not contain the pressure, but it will not hurt you if there is a failure. So, you know, that's about as confident as I could, I could say we are. I shoot them, I'll probably never shoot another aluminum AR. Uh, uh, I mean, other than my personal carbon fiber. If I catch you, Josh, shooting an aluminum AR here at Industry Day at the range, you know I'm going to break your balls. We're going to have the camera roll. I grew up in an injection molding factory. I was put on a four jaw when I was 12. And Sounds like a violation of state law continuum. It, it, yeah, OSHA would not have liked me operating a four jaw as a young teenager. But being around manufacturing, being in an injection molding company, I slowly gained faith in polymers. And, you know, that starts with Glock paving the way. Okay. And uh, we're trying to do similar things. Playing to my sympathies, I get it. Yeah, and so we're trying to Glockify AR in a sense. And this is step one. Pencil barrel. Pencil barrel. One and seven twist? gas block. Okay, what's the twist rate on the barrel? Twist rate? One eight. Okay, one and eight. And uh, who makes it? Oh, we make it. Okay, you make the barrel. Yeah. Okay, tell me about the muzzle device you got on there. The muzzle device is a uh, night brake. Um, it's very similar to Sven uh, at Manicore Arms. His, he designed it for us, except it's just a two port as opposed to, okay. I think, his three. Is there anything before we conclude this video that you want to say to the commenters who are absolutely losing their minds right now about a plastic AR-15? If you don't like it, buy something else. Uh, hey, I like it. I love the energy. If you don't I mean, like it, fuck right off. <laughs> there's plenty of people here selling what I call Me Too products. They saw something and they went, Me Too, I'll make that too. What did you bring to the table? We anodized it a different color. We cut it up a little di differently. Invest in tooling. Invest in the means of production. Invest in lowering the cost of your damn product. That's what we're doing. Preach, brother. Preach, Josh. Thank, thank you, you so much for Thanks grabbing for me. I really appreciate you showing me the, uh, the Warp 15 uh, TVD. TVD. Guys, stay tuned. We're bringing you more from SHOT Show 2024.